hi guys this is your teacher Nodia and in this video we will be doing a review about the topic of equalities and inequalities in order to complete this please go to the page number 31 of your pathway to math book we are going to do a couple of examples of what we have in the same page now you already completed this page however i am going to do a review we are going to go to a summary of this same activities so you can be more clear of what you have to do in this page in the first part that says number six it says complete each equality let's couple the first example it says four plus then it has a blank space equal 8 now what you have to do is write in this blank space the number that is missing so when you do the math 4 plus that number it's going to give you number 8 now we already have 4 let's start from the number we already have and it's going to be easier for us to find the number that is missing let's try it we already have 4 five six seven eight great we already reach up to eight how many sticks do we have here one two three four great we have four that means that the number that goes in the blank space is the number four this is how we complete this activity in the book let's try another one let's try this one it says 21 plus blank space is equal 25 let's see we are going to try and do the same thing we already have 21 we are going to count the missing numbers until we reach to 25 and that's going to be the result that we have to put in the blank space let's try it we already have 21 22 23 24 and 25 we already reach out to 25 let's count how many sticks we have one two three four that means that the number that goes in the blank space is the number four perfect now let's try another one but with subtraction let's try the first one we have 45 minus blank space is equal 40. we have to find the number or actually the amount we have to subtract from 25 in order to reach out to 40. an easy way to complete this is the following between these two numbers you are going to do an operation take the bigger number which is 45 and put it in the top and then take the smaller number and put it in the bottom let's try it how much is 5 minus 0 is 0 I'm sorry is 5 so we are going to put the number 5 here how much is 4 minus 4 is 0 so what we have as a result is 5 that means that we are going to put 5 here that means that 45 minus 5 is equal 40 let's try the second one we have 28 minus blank space is equal 18 let's do the same thing between these two let's take the bigger number in this case the bigger number is 28 let's take the number 28 minus the smaller one 18 perfect how much is 8 minus 8 is 0 let's put the 0 right here how much is 2 minus 1 if I have 2 and I remove 1 then I only have 1 that means that the final result is 10 so I am going to put the 10 right here that means that 28 
minus 10 is 18. This is the easiest way to complete this activity here. Now, let's try the second section. I am going to copy this information. So we have 18 plus 5 is equal 20 plus 6. It's asking us if that's correct or incorrect. Let's find out. Let's start with this part. Let's take the bigger number, which is 18, and the smallest number, which is 5. And then, let's take, this is an addition problem, because this is the sign we have right here. This one is also an addition problem. Let's take the bigger one first, plus the smaller one. Okay, let's try this one first. How much is 8 plus 5? If you don't know how much is 8 plus 5, let's try it this way. We already have 8. Let's add 5. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 8 plus 5 is 13. I am going to put the number 3 here. And the one I'm going to carry it up now how much is 1 plus 1 is 2 excellent so 18 plus 5 is 23 let's try 20 plus 6 this one is an easier one how much is 0 plus 6 is 6 and now we take down the 2 so in this one we have 23 and in the other one we have 26. Are these numbers equals? No, they are not. So it's actually incorrect because they are not equal. This is the correct way to complete this activity in this section. Now I have a couple of activities for you to practice. You have to complete the activities from page number 33 into 35 of your book. I want to complete one of these examples for you so you can know what is the correct way to do it. With your pencil, let's do the first one. So you have to continue the sequence and then put the pattern in this blank space. Let's see, we have 23, then we have 25, and then we have 27. Are we adding or removing? We are adding. Since we are adding, we are going to put a plus sign right here. Now you have to find out how much are we adding. We are actually adding 2. Let's see. 27 plus 2 is 29. 29 plus 2 is 31. And 31 plus 2 is 33. As you can see, I continue the sequence. 23 plus 2 is 25. And 25 plus 2 is 27. And that's why I continue with the sequence, adding 2. So we are adding 2. In case you remove, then you are going to put the sign for remove followed by the number.